Is it the right time to buy or sell Google stock? Let's dive deep into Google in this video. We initially published our report on our website on Wednesday, December 20, 2023. And now, we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Make sure you subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Take your trading decisions to the next level with our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get free price predictions and deep analysis for any of the 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Starting from December 18, 2023, our system has identified Google as a promising investment opportunity, giving it a score of 2.92. Now, let's delve into the stock's performance during this period. The stock has shown a gain of 1.8%. In other words, on average, it has yielded a daily return of 0.6% since being identified as a buy candidate. The stock is currently in the upper range of a wide and horizontal trend. Typically, this would indicate a good selling opportunity. However, if the stock breaks through the top trend line at $142.77, it could signal a strong buy opportunity and a shift in the trend. Looking at the three-month trend, there is a potential 0.97% change expected over the next three months. This means the stock could experience a return between minus 10.20% and 3.22%. On the other hand, the 12-month trend suggests a significant 54.41% change over the next year. This could result in a potential return between 45.21% and 68.29%. In terms of price, this translates to a range of $202.80 to $235.03 after one year. Our latest update for Google reveals that the stock price increased by 1.13% on Wednesday. On the last trading day, which was Wednesday, December 20, 2023, the Google stock price rose from $138.10 to $139.66, marking a gain of 1.13%. This positive trend has continued for four consecutive days. It will be interesting to see if the stock can maintain its upward momentum or if it will take a brief pause in the coming days. During the last trading day, the stock price fluctuated between a low of $139.41 and a high of $143.08, representing a 2.63% change. Over the past 10 days, the price has risen on six occasions, resulting in a 6.26% increase over the last two weeks. Furthermore, the trading volume has also increased, with 13 million more shares being traded compared to the previous day. In total, approximately 33 million shares were bought and sold, amounting to a total value of around $4.65 billion. Looking at the past 52 weeks, the highest recorded stock price for Google was $143.08, while the lowest price was $85.57. As of now, the current price is 2.39%, equivalent to $3.42, below the 52-week high and 94.47%, equivalent to $2,387.33, below the all-time high reached on June 11, 2021, when the price peaked at $2,526.99. Analyst Ratings On Wednesday, October 25, 2023, it was reported that Needham gave Google a buy grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, July 26, 2023, Susquehanna gave Google a positive grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, July 26, 2023, KeyBank gave Google an overweight grade with a hold action. On Wednesday, May 24, 2023, JMP Securities gave Google a market outperform grade with a hold action. On Thursday, May 4, 2023, Credit Suisse gave Google a neutral grade with a hold action. Analysts have given Google stock a general buy rating. They rate the P-E ratio as a strong buy and the price to book as strong buy. When it comes to return on investment, the analysts give the stock a rating of neutral.
let's take a look at the signals for Google stock. Both short and long-term moving averages show buy signals for Google stock, indicating a positive forecast. Additionally, the relation between these two signals confirms a general buy signal, with the short-term average above the long-term average. In case of any downward corrections, the stock will find support at $135.66 and $134.84. However, if the stock breaks below these levels, sell signals will be issued. Moving on, the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD, also gives a buy signal. As the volume rises along with the price, this is considered a good technical signal. However, there are some negative signals that may impact the near short-term development. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Wednesday, November 22, 2023, resulting in a 0.257% fall so far. It is expected to decrease further until a new bottom pivot is found. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, there is a buy signal. Pivots, there was a sell signal 20 days ago. Bollinger, a buy signal was observed 38 days ago. Short-term moving average, a buy signal was detected 4 days ago. Long-term moving average, there was a sell signal 6 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, there was a buy signal 25 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart, we see Short moving average, a buy signal was identified 4 days ago. The long-term moving average, a buy signal was identified 4 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, a buy signal was observed 191 days ago. Remember to visit our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Google Google has found support from accumulated volume at $133.84. This provides a potential buying opportunity as we can expect an upward reaction when the support level is tested. When it comes to trading this stock, the volume is usually quite good, and the risk is considered to be low due to minor daily changes. In the last day, the stock had a price range of $3.67, 2.63%, between its high and low points. Over the past week, the stock has shown an average daily volatility of 2.34%. Before we dive into the potential trading levels for Google, let's quickly go over some important fundamental data. First, let's talk about the price-to-earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This ratio compares a company's current share price to its per-share earnings. Google has a relatively normal P-E ratio, which is often seen in businesses with a long history or predictable revenues. Moving on to the latest news, the next earnings report for Q4 2023 is expected on February 01, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates for Google's earnings are at $1.60. It's important to keep an eye on these numbers as they can significantly impact the stock prices. Today, we'll be discussing some potential day trading levels for Google. Let's start with the upward trend. The first resistance level for Google is at $140.12. If you don't own any shares, it might be wise to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. However, for those who already hold the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. Now, let's look at the downside. Google encounters its first support level at $133.84. If this support level holds, it could serve as a good entry point, with the anticipation of a rebound. According to multiple analyst sources, Google has received a combined average rating of buy. Now, let's delve into some recent insider trades. On December 11, 2023, Hennessy John L. sold 101 shares of Class C Capital stock. On December 11, 2023, Hennessy John L. sold 99 shares of Class C Capital stock. On December 6, 2023, Pichai Sundar sold 14,769 shares of Class C Capital stock. On December 6, 2023, Pichai Sundar sold 7,731 shares of Class C Capital stock. On December 1, 2023, 
GV 2023 GP, LLC bought zero shares of common stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, the insider power has been calculated as negative with a ratio of minus 8.577. In total, insiders have purchased 1,485,261 shares and sold 1,758,706 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss for this stock is set at $134.37, which represents a decrease of 3.79%. This particular stock tends to have low daily movements, which translates to lower risk for investors. Additionally, we have identified a sell signal from a pivot top that occurred 19 days ago. Is it a good time to invest in Google stock? Based on short-term signals, it appears that the current level could present a buying opportunity for Google stock. There is a fair chance for it to perform well in the short-term period. Our analysis of volatility and movements from the last trading day suggests that the current price is undervalued. When trading resumes on Thursday, December 21, we anticipate Google to open up $1.06 and start trading at $140.72. Before we dive into today's topic, it's important to remember that trading comes with a risk. It's always a good idea to consult with a financial advisor before making any investment decisions. Additionally, please note that StockInvest.us is not a basis for your investment choices. By using the information provided, you agree to take responsibility for your own investment decisions. Welcome to our channel, Stock Invest. Today, we want to share our current view of the stock and hear your thoughts. Whether you agree or disagree, we encourage you to comment below and join the conversation. We're curious to know your target for this stock as well. Remember, if you find this information valuable, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. By doing so, you'll stay updated with the latest insights and trading strategies. We genuinely hope you find success in your trading endeavors, and we wish you a beautiful day. Thank you for tuning in, and we appreciate your support. Now let's dive into our analysis.